Hey science lovers, it's Becky with Lab Rat Academy and I have some really fun flowers here. These are called composite flowers. That's because these are made up of hundreds of flowers that you can't really see. So I'm gonna do a little bit of a flower dissection so I can help you identify the different parts of a composite flower. So the first thing I want you to notice on this one is that it has a two different parts. We have the yellow part in the middle and then we have the purple on the outside. Normally we would call these the petals, but in this case, these are called our ray florets. This is one single flower, this little thing right here. And this little thing has an ovary, which has an egg inside of it, and has a pistil and a stamen all inside this one thing. The ones that are on the inside, these here, these are called the disc florets. They make the disc of the flower. And those are single individual flowers that have an ovary and an egg, which is called the ovule, and it has the pistil and the stamen as well. So we're gonna cut this open and see what's on the inside. Perfect, now you can see that we have our disc florets right here on the inside. And this is a receptacle on the bottom that's holding all of them together. And these are the ray florets that are around the outside. So if I take my forceps right here and I pull off one of these disc florets, you'll notice that they are teeny tiny little flowers. This right here at the bottom is the ovary with an egg that will produce the seed. Then if you look at these right here, you will also see this is our ray floret. And it also has the ovary at the base down here with an egg inside of it, which is called the ovule and that will produce a seed for this flower. If you bend it just right, you can see that we have a pistil just inside here. The pistil is the female part, which has the ovary right next to it, and the pistil will receive the pollen and it will go down into the ovary and pollinate that ovule and that will create the seed. And there are some flowers like these ones that don't even have the disc florets. You can see that they are all ray florets. Wow, science is so amazing. I hope you guys have a beautiful day. God bless. Bye-bye.